Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, Charles Young, also known as Open Thoughts. Hey, follow me on OpenThoughts.com. That's Open, T-H-O-T-S dot com. Hey, so what I want to talk to you about is something that personally is affecting me right now, but I'm not complaining about it, is it's my family. Now, family is your worst critic. That's mainly what I want to talk about is a lot of the times we feel that family is supposed to have our back and they're supposed to be our backbone, but a lot, but... For the most part, that's not really true, especially when it's coming to doing something that you love to do, doing something that you uh, uh, desire, you you have a passion for. They never really see the whole effort of it. But let's think about it. Aren't these the same individuals who watch TV and support and root for other individuals to become successful in their crafts or their skills or whatever they're doing in competitions like American Idol, So You Think You Can Dance, but they're not really supportive of your dreams. So stop expecting them to be the individuals who support what you do because they don't understand it and it's not their shoes. So they would respond differently. Now I'm not telling you to be upset because they don't support you. I know that I know that we 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 tend to go to family first to our a lot of our uh works when we're doing something great. We want to tell our family because we want to hear that positivity, that uh, uplifting encouragement. But the truth really is is families don't really support you. Um coming on uh, the situation that I'm dealing with is that, you know, a lot of the times I make videos and I like to make people laugh and I may do stuff that is uh, basically what we didn't grow up doing. You know, I'm coming out of a Christian background. Now, coming out of a Christian background, y'all should know how people are, how they strict are. And we're from that authentic Christian background, that traditional Christian background. So, uh, you know, they don't understand some of the things that I'm doing or what I'm coming out and saying and a lot of my messages are to open people's minds why the hell do you think my name is called open thoughts so looking at that I don't get upset with them I don't I'm not uh, mad about it I'm just saying hey you don't understand what I'm doing it's okay it's understandable I can't be mad at my family that's how they want to handle these situations I'm not mad about that, and but I'm telling you people this is because, especially if you're a younger viewer, don't be upset because your family just doesn't get it. They just don't get it. They won't understand it. They don't understand your craft. They don't understand your passion. They just don't get it, and it's okay. Don't beat yourself up. Don't give up on what you love to do for somebody else because you're going to have to then live with the regret that you didn't do it. Don't let any other individual control what you want to do, what you love to do. Don't let them influence you to forget and give up who you are. You know, a lot of the time we can get some criticism and criticism is good. For sometimes criticism is great. You got to look at, you just got to look at how you're going to say it. You know, my grandmother always telling me when you eat the fruit, you eat the fruit, but you spit out the seeds. So you basically take what you need and you flip out the stuff you don't need. So look at it that way. Think of it. Take it as positive. Don't turn everything such as a negative. Somebody says, well, I really don't like what you're doing. Ask them, do they watch TV? Okay. Ask them, do they watch TV? That's what I would tell you to do. Ask them, do you watch TV? Okay, now start asking them what's their favorite shows. Now start asking them what's their favorite reality shows. Now start asking them what's their favorite sports shows. If they have a favorite team. If they start giving you information about certain shows and certain things that they love on TV and who they're rooting for. Or even if you're sitting down with them and you can see how passionate they get into somebody else's craft and gift. And they want them to make it and get mad when they don't make it. Just take it as... It's not the fact they don't care, it's they don't understand. Because anytime you can root and celebrate some other individual doing something very similar to what you're doing, but yet not encourage the people that are in your own family, you have a problem. <laughs> I would say that I think it's a real problem and we got to break out of that. So I thank you guys for listening. Uh, hey, follow me on OpenThoughts.com. Follow me on Facebook, Blogger, Twitter, Tumblr. All the information will be at the link below. So, hey, people, y'all have a good one.
Peace.